We're looking here at a very pleasing assortment or lot of eight books, six different titles. Of these photogravure uh, books that were published in the uh, last decades of the 19th century and the early part of the 20th century, they are distinguished by all having a profusion of image plates beautifully printed in a photogravure method, all with tissue guards that are lettered uh, facing them. They also typically come in these very ornate and decorative uh, bindings. Many of them are published by the firm um, Coates, although this one here says John Winston Company on the spine, but coats here. And so uh, there's also this list of illustrations within. And again, we see city views and people and um, works of art, monuments, etc. There really is just a profusion of them. And they're all very clean and fresh internally. Yeah, very, very nice uh, era of book production. And sometimes, often, some of the views like this will contain uh, city uh, plazas and piazzas and squares uh, with people and activity. Here's a beautiful two-volume set on the Rhine, looking almost as close to new as a book can. That's 120 uh, years old. And this one here, Again, a profusion of these uh, beautiful photogravure plates throughout. It's difficult to fully capture the number and the range of them, but some of these sets have, I believe, if I recall correctly, something in the range of 50 illustrations or more in them. Um, yes, there's a great one right there with all kinds of people doing things and that's a marketplace, and so on. So there's this one, and then the companion volume is just more images. This set here, uh, yes, I would say this set here probably has at least 50 views. Uh, interesting s street frontage. Um, and let's see, oh yes, there's a water view there along the harbor. And there's a bird's eye of the cathedral, and so on. Then we've got this one on Florence, Italy. Look at that cover. You could display that. There is a fold-out map of the city at the rear that's done in such a way on an inset tab that you can close the book like so. And then you could have this here while you go through the book and you read about the many uh, splendid aspects of visiting Florence, um, right, home of the Medicis and so on. Uh, a person could spend a year in Florence and just scratch the surface of what there is to see. Oh yes, there's one of the great famous piazzas here right near the Uffizi Museum. That's the Loggia dei Lanzi, and so on. Yes, the many palaces and courtyards and uh, architectural wonders of the city. Here is Rambles in Greece, a view on the Acropolis. And there we have a beautiful uh, photogravure. And again, just a profusion of them throughout. There must be a list, yes, at the front here. Uh, and this one attributes the photogravures to Elson and company. And let's see what we've got here for a date on this. We're looking at 1900. The final two volumes set of this collection is 1905, about terrain, and 
Chambord and so on. Ah, there we go, that's beautiful. Uh, and so now this uh, collection is currently available on my website, briandemambro.com.